If all else is silent, I can hear it. If I don't move, I can feel it. It has a rhythm, a steady pulse, a heartbeat. I live out in the middle of nowhere. No neighbors within sight, no businesses, no avalanching mountains, no stampedes. Only very rarely do I see a vehicle drive by. And if what I've been experiencing is an earthquake, then it's been long and slow and rhythmic. One late morning, I decided to stick a shovel into the dirt and see what I could uncover. But something strange happened when I pierced the earth. The heartbeat quickened. I immediately stopped digging and stood there gazing fixedly at the thumping land. As I did so, all that sang and chirped and clicked fell silent, and dark clouds rolled in turning the bright, sunny morning to one shadowed and gray. There'd been no call for weather of that kind. Nervously, I lifted the shovel. Then, with all my strength, thrust the sharpened head into the ground once more. The sky bellowed overhead. The subterranean throbbing grew more rapid. The land is alive. I'm sure of it. And not just the ground, but the sky above, too. The two of them, seemingly intertwined. Maybe as allies. Maybe as a single entity. Or perhaps, as outrageous as it may sound, the Earth itself is sentient. I chose to heed the warning that day to leave the land unmarked and hope that it would respond to me in kind. As I'd made my way back to the shed to put away a shovel which I might never use again, nature livened back up. The birds and insects resumed their songs, which sounded almost jubilant by then, and the land became iridescent like before, illuminated beneath the nooning sun. I glimpsed up toward the clear blue sky. Under my feet was a calm, rhythmic pulse. <laughs>